Water cement ratio is the ratio of a water to cement by weight, b water to cement by volume, c cement to water by weight, d cement to water by volume. Answer A. Water to cement by weight. Water cement ratio is the ratio of weight of water to the weight of cement. Its normal value lies between 0.4 to 0.6 as per is code 10262, 2009, for nominal mixes. Concrete is the macro content and contains cement, sand, coarse aggregate, fine aggregate and water. The entrain air in concrete. A increases the strength. B decreases the resistance to weathering. C increases the workability. D decreases the workability. Answer C. Increases the workability. Effect of air entertainment on concrete strength. Air entrainment affects compressive strength of concrete and its workability. It increases the workability of concrete without much increase in water cement ratio. Compressive strength of concrete is inversely proportional to workability of concrete. Concrete is unsuitable for compaction by vibration if it is a semi plastic, B plastic, C earth moist, D dry. Answer B. Plastic. Can plastic be used in concrete? It can be deduced from this research that, waste plastics are not good materials that can be used to improve compressive strength development in concrete matrix but they can be used in the production of lightweight concrete in construction. In order to avoid segregation fresh concrete should be dropped from a height of a less than 1 meter, b less than 2 meters, c more than 1 meter, d more than 2 meters. Answer A. Usually they limit the freefall distance to 3 to 5 feet, 0.9 to 1.5 meters, but occasionally the limit is as little as 2 feet, 0.6 meters. Neither a C-300-199, specifications for structural concrete, nor C-300-1802, building code requirements for structural concrete, limit the maximum distance concrete can free fall. The process of hardening of concrete in the presence of water is called A creep B. Hydration C. Shrinkage D. Curing. Answer B. Hydration. The water causes the hardening of concrete through a process called hydration. Hydration is a chemical reaction in which the major compounds in cement form chemical bonds with water molecules and become hydrates or hydration products. The process of keeping the concrete structure moist is called a hydration, B curing, C creep, D shrinkage. Answer B. Why the curing of cement concrete is required? The curing of cement concrete is required for the following reasons. 1. To prevent the concrete from drying out prematurely due to solar radiation and wind. 2. To maintain the concrete temperature by allowing the hydration process. 3 to harden and bond with internal materials and reinforcement. This helps to prevent damage to the bond between concrete and reinforcement due to vibration and impact. 4. To development of impermeable, crack-free, and durable concrete. The separation of water or water cement mixture from the freshly laid concrete is known as a workability, B segregation, C bleeding, D creep, answer C causes a bleeding.
Segregation is the cause of bleeding in the concrete mix. Segregation is the phenomena in which heavy aggregate particles settles down. Due to settling of heavy particles, water rises up to the surface and forms a layer. The separate movement of water also carries fine particles of cement with it. The continuous strain, which the concrete undergoes due to application of external loads, is called a creep, B bleeding, C workability, D segregation, answer A. A material behaves differently when subjected to an instantaneous high stress or a constant stress for a certain amount of time. When under continuous mechanical stress, a material tends to move gradually or deform in a permanent manner. This natural tendency is called creep. The process of conversion of plastic concrete to solid stage is called a hydration, B hardening, C setting, D curing, answer C. Setting time of cement concrete stages and processes. The action of changing mixed cement from a fluid state to a solid state is called setting of cement and time required for it to set is called setting time of cement. Setting time of cement is same as setting time of concrete. At 28 days of curing concrete attains a strength of a 20 to 25 percent, B 60 to 70 percent. C 65 to 80 percent, D 90 to 95 percent. Answer D. The table below shows the compressive strength gained by concrete after 1, 3, 7, 14 and 28 days with respect to the grade of concrete we use. From above table, we see that concrete gains 16 percent strength in 1 day, 40 percent in 3 days. 65% in 7 days, 90% in 14 days and 99% strength in 28 days.